Welcome to Canadian PGA TV. We're here in Moncton, New Brunswick at the annual general meeting and uh, it's the day after the uh, the big vote, the big PACE vote. Uh, PACE program has passed. Lyndon, uh, unbelievable stuff. And uh, your dinner last night uh, as the outgoing president, Mr. Lyndon Guerin, uh, they had a great night for us last night. And uh, Lyndon, tell us about, uh, first of all, before we get into last night, let's talk about the PACE program. And mm -hmm. uh, the program has passed. Uh, exciting stuff. Uh, does it feel like winning a major championship somewhat? I, I think it's satisfying for sure, Jeff, but it's, uh, I think I've always stressed all along that it's, it wasn't about me. Mm -hmm. This is about our association, and, and I think it, it shows uh, how our, our association has evolved and how our members have, uh, have embraced this program, and it's, it's going to mean so much for our, uh, for our members, create some opportunities, uh, uh, increase our credibility and so on in the industry, and, and uh, I applaud the members. Um, you know, uh, uh, two years ago, it didn't make it, uh, but we made it better. And uh, and our uh, our members have responded to that by uh, by approving the program. It's so awesome. Some people say actually that when it didn't pass the first time, almost the best thing ever happened to the, to the PACE program in a way because members became this. They came they came out of the woodwork. Certain people and they wanted to have their voice heard. And they want to talk about it. And you got a chance to talk to most of those members. Yeah, I think that that is is absolutely correct. Uh, you know, certainly would have been nice to pass it two years ago. We'd be down the road. We still would have revised it. Uh, that's always been the plan, and it will continue to be. And and this program will evolve. But I think it brought. Our association very close, brought us closer together. Uh, we had some very passionate discussions um, and a lot of good feedback from our members, which w were incorporated into the PACE program. And it would have been anyway, but uh, it, it, it sped up the process. I think it certainly gave me a great opportunity to get to know members across the country, and it shows how passionate they are about our association. And I think that. Uh, it's not just about pace. It was about our association coming together as a group, all our zones. No. Now, Lyndon, tell us about uh, last night. You know, a ph phenomenal night. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm sure for you, it was it was probably it was it was enjoyable in one sense, but it must have been a little bit sad to kind of see it end. I'm sure. But tell us about last night and how how, you, how it made you feel. Yeah, it's it's, it's awesome, obviously, to uh, to share an evening with your friends, uh, people you've worked with. Uh, you become friends with everybody. Uh, family were here, obviously, and my sister, who is a little bit older than I am, uh, she attended. It was it was awesome. Um, you know, to, to see friends come together, have a little fun, uh, poke a little fun at each other, uh, always always a lot of fun. Uh, Jim Remy, PGA of America, was here. Uh, uh, you know, you, you create a lot of tremendous friendships, and that's probably the challenging part about going away. Everybody has to go away. Yeah. Uh, you know, you, you do your thing. We, you know, we have various people across the country that are, are contributing in a big way to our association, and, and, uh, and we'll have, we have a new president. We have a new a vice president, a new secretary, and they'll do a wonderful job. Um, and you, you come in, you, you work hard, uh, you hopefully get some satisfaction out of it, which I certainly did. You can hopefully make a difference, which I hope I did, uh, and certainly the new guys will as well. Now, you'll still be involved as past president, uh, a little bit involved, and uh, is there a more exciting time right now for the members of the Canadian PGA with the PACE program passing, the centennial coming up? I mean, this is, in history, this has got to be one of the one of the best moments for the members. Yeah, without overstating it, back when, when we first started talking about PACE and, and how I felt, uh, you know, th this is historical for our association. Th this this is phenomenal. Uh, as everybody knows, the board did not have to take this to the membership initially to vote on it. We could have put it through, but I think that it shows the confidence the board has uh, in their membership and and the programs that, that that are in place. And we've got so many other initiatives in in the works. And obviously, 2011 is going to be our centennial. That's going to be a tremendous year. Um, you know, employment strategies in, in the works. Uh, it just goes on and on. Uh, we're ver working diligently towards our Canadian PGA Championship and and hopefully we can get that back on track and, and I've said in the past that, that this event deserves to be a, a, a tremendous stature event mm -hmm. it's not about just bringing it back it needs to be something that that, that championship deserves and I think we're getting very close so. And Lyndon, final question for you. Uh, a lot of work. You've, been, you've worked so hard the last couple of years. You're going to have a little bit more free time, hopefully, for yourself. Um, any plans, what you're going to do? Uh, where you're building a golf course. Yeah. Will, will you have more time now to spend on the bulldozer? Or? Yeah, well, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. New hobby, buying bulldozers. Yeah, <laughs> no, for sure. I'll, I'll certainly enjoy that. And it's uh, it's always been a passion of mine, uh, um, sort of golf course design and, and that sort of thing, to be able to pursue my dream of, of, uh, of owning a facility and uh, residential. Uh, I I think it's uh, yeah it's I'm gonna have some time to spend with family uh, that's for sure um, and and uh, you know he's not out to pasture but as a past president it's gonna be enjoyable it's really gonna be enjoyable I think that 
that we owe it uh, to our association to uh, to applaud the work of people that are in place. And uh, we all have different tactics, all have different ways of handling things, and all have different contributions that we may have made to our association. And uh, uh, I'm looking forward to that. Looking forward to having a little free time, but uh, get back at it. Uh, you know, uh, uh, I don't talk about it much, but certainly I, I've gone through a few health challenges. I think some people know that. And uh, I think it's, it's awesome that we've gotten involved with prostate cancer. Mm -hmm. Uh, Canada, and uh, hopefully I can be maybe contribute to the association a little bit in that respect. Yeah, looking forward to it. Well, Jeff, it has been a pleasure yeah, working with our staff. It's, yeah. We've always had a lot of fun, yeah. and uh, I, I think our members need to know uh, that we have tremendous staff, mm -hmm. tremendous staff. Gary's doing a wonderful job. It's just short short time on the new job. Yeah. Uh, you've done a wonderful job, Craig, uh, Darcy, uh, MJ. It's, uh, you know, the, the, the work that, that our staff do for our association is phenomenal. It's great to be uh, a board person to be able to to work with you. Well, you know, we, we couldn't do it without the support of the board and, and yourself, Lyndon, a fantastic president for us and a great two years and we'll enjoy having you around, around and involved still a little more and like I said before, hopefully have some more free time to, to do what you want to do. So thanks again, awesome. really, really appreciate it and uh, well, all the best. Thanks, Jeff. Thanks.